Hi everyone, I am Dr. Maheshwari, Fertility Consultant from Oasis Fertility, Ananaga, Chennai. In this video, we just touch upon sperm selection process for IVF in male infertility. In sperm selection process, there are methods like magnetic assorted cell sorting and microfluidics. Coming on to the first thing, max. Where can we do max? When the patient is having a repeated implantation failure or in men with higher DFI, higher DNA fragmentation index, we can suggest them max. So, MAX is the process of separating the apoptotic sperms from the normal sperms. Okay. So, we just uh, place the processed semen sample in the magnetic field where the abnormal sperms can get attached to it and only the normal sperms we can get we can be passed through the field and we can get the field and we can use those sperms for doing ICSI. By means of this, we can avoid the apoptotic sperms and we can take the non-apoptotic sperms and which can be taken for ICSI. Now uh, coming on to microfluidics. Microfluidics is a natural way of selecting the sperm for uh, ICSI. So here the one advantage here is he, we won't process the semen sample because while processing the sample while passing through the centrifuge it can cause damage to the sperms. Here we won't process the semen sample, we just place the fresh semen sample in the chip and it is allowed to pass through a barrel column. And here the column mimics the environment of the fallopian tube. So we get the natural, natural way of sperm selection and we get the sperms which is rich in motility. So we can use those sperms for go ahead with ICSI. So by means of max and microfluidics we can select a sperms and we can help in getting good fertilization as well as good embryo formation. So max we can definitely offer for the people with uh, higher DFI as well as recurrent implantation failure. Thank you so much.